Hey, Dimitri. Thank you so much for the uh, the turnaround. So, um, wow. <laughs> I'm excited. This is super cool. So let me just jump in and show you what we got. Dun, 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 dun. I am quite happy with the result. Um, I think I think that, uh, and the cool part is, is that if I crank up the animation, uh, I can also adjust essentially the oscillation for the inside. I think you really nailed it. I think you nailed exactly what we are going for. It's in our style, um, and uh, it's not, um, you know, it's, it's not a pixel art style, which is great. Uh, I took, added the grayscale image, and then uh, just did a quick uh, test in Photoshop to see if I could turn it to uh, to hue tint it to pink. So the the bottom laser is essentially the grayscale with me just doing a, a hue shift in Photoshop. So it makes life a little bit easier. Feel free um, with the colors if you want to like, because we, we still need blue and green. If uh, you feel like you can do better than just hue shifting, totally fine uh, for delivering those. Uh, the other piece of feedback, let's switch over to the new asset name. So I, I put those into the Trello card. Um, dude, I think this is, this is, uh, this is it. So let's go on to, uh, let's go on to, uh, uh, maybe the, um, let's do the emitter and then let's do the end cap, uh, as, as our next bits, uh, unless you want to do more as well. I know, I, I know we have a, a, a few bits to clean up, um, a, you know, in terms of the, the seams and whatnot. So, um, also I think you could probably just scale it up, but I have, I have, uh, I have this, um, I can only make things so big in the engine. So, um, and I really, I have always had this dream of like a giant, almost giant screen filling laser. So before we get too down, far down the road, uh, how about we do a, do, give, give me a 4K version of, um, of the texture sheet. So we'll just res it up here. Um, right now we're in, in 10 and 24. So I think a uh, 4K would be uh, super, super good there. Um, and let me, uh, let me pause this real quick. And I'll just take a look. Okay, we're back. Yeah, so uh, I don't think you have to worry about a, a 4K version. I can always scale up if I need to. Uh, I need to figure out in the engine how I can make a giant a giant laser, um, a full like screen filling laser, or almost like a half screen filling laser. Uh, there's some issues when I scale things up. Um, very well could be I need a large texture um, enemy, but you don't have to worry about that. Anyways, okay. So we're on the right track. That's great. Um, just as a reminder, I think here, when we talk about um, the uh the laser emitter um let's try to do kind of maybe something where it should be frame based so it should animate and, and warble so it should have a nice like a hot like pulsing uh center uh think about like a spade so it can be circular um bigger than the uh than the ideally um it's uh let's see here ideally oh let's try it one more time catch it ideally the um the emitter can be big enough to kind of capture um, the the width. I can always scale it, scale it up, but I'm thinking like a like a like a spade maybe, um, or a teardrop shape, um, and then we can pulsate that, and then yeah, and then we can work on um, the impact sprites and what that looks like. Okay, this is great. Um, I'm about ready to run off. I have a a, a wonderful date, so I'm gonna go jump in the shower and get cleaned up. Uh, and I hope you have a good weekend, and I'll speak to you soon. Thank you.